Hello, so this week at Meadowcroft we've got our annual Pansy and Viola Festival. Now we have this every year because some of the growers like to test all their new varieties and then we sell them in the garden centre. But one thing that you might not know about them is that they're actually edible, so you can eat those on your salads. So I actually thought that what I might do today is plant up a pot and a hanging basket. So I filled this pot with our own, own Meadowcroft compost because that's a good one to use just for bedding plants and it does have a little feed in that will last a few months. Now if you've got a basket you might have one with a plastic liner. If you have you will need to pierce it because otherwise it will get waterlogged if we have a lot of rain. So I'm just going to pierce that there before I put the compost in. So. I'm going to start with a couple of violas in my pot, or actually maybe three. So just push those down. I like to cram quite a lot in my pots, because then you get more nice things in there and lots more colour as the year goes on. Well, these uh, violas will keep going right through the summer and they're a little bit better than pansies because sometimes pansies don't like the heat but the violas don't seem to mind. So I'm also going to put in a cheeky little strawberry because I really like strawberries in my pims. I'm not really a lover of the cucumber. I like a nice sweet strawberry in my drink. So I'm going to pop that one in there and I've also got a little basil mint which is really nice. So you've got a few nice things for your barbecue, for all your salads. You can just make your salad and scatter all your little flowers of your violas over your salad. It looks really pretty. So for my hanging basket to match or just to go with it, I'm going to do some more violas in there. And if you put these around the edges, they will actually flop over. But if you really want to you can buy trailing violas and you still can eat them it's not a problem so I'm going to pop three of these in my basket so that they just droop over the sides when they get bigger all in there and in the middle I'm going to put some of this lovely um, lemon variegated thyme it has an absolute lovely smell um, lovely lemony smell and it also will keep all the mozzies and mosquitoes and gnats away so I'm just going to pop that in the middle that gets a little bit higher than the violas and that will just sort of hang up and the smell should be delicious so if you're popping in this week, do come and have a look at our lovely greenhouse. It is really full of colour. It's got every colour you would want in the violas. And uh, if you want to make yourself a little edible pot or hanging basket, there we are.